I was by his side the whole time, talking to him, praying over him, holding his hand, you know, rubbing his head. That unconditional love just rushes over you, and here is this helpless baby that has been entrusted to me, and I can't do anything for him. Parker Krilecki was born with hydrocephalus, a condition in which spinal fluid fills the cranial cavity, crowding out the baby's brain. In a normal birth, the brain occupies 90 to 95% of the cranial cavity. Parker's tiny brain occupied less than 5% of the volume of his skull. There was only a rim, a tiny few millimeter rim of brain cells around the circumference. It was astounding. At the time of birth, what you have is basically the building blocks or the precursor for the rapid development that is going to occur in the next two years, especially, of life. They were ready and waiting for him, and Dr. Reisner took him to the operating room within a few days to relieve that pressure and to drain the fluid. Over the next few months, Parker had a series of surgeries to drain more fluid and to reshape his skull. Our goal was to go in and re-expand the skull, open the skull up and, and separate those bones that had grown together. And that was basically what we did, getting the space for his brain to grow and to, and to grow normally. What Children's has always been for me is like, like an extension of me. Every time that we've had to hand Parker off to a nurse who would take him to a surgery or while well, he was in the NICU or the PICU, I knew that every person there cared for him almost as much as I did. We took him home at two weeks old and we started physical therapy at four weeks. It took him a long time to sit up and hold his head up. He never crawled. He went to pulling up and then walking. It was about 15 months when he got the glasses. He is truly a very brave child. He has been through so much. He has always had a smile on his face. Parker is a little chatterbox. He constantly wants to see people. He's such a loving child. He will always just give us kisses and hugs and smiles all the time. He's got a laugh that will just melt your heart. He's a miracle. Parker has not only met all our hopes, but in so many ways exceeded them by far. We are humble partners of parents. They loved everything they'd been given, and they totally accepted, without question, this very special child. If there is love and conscience and the heart is in the right place, great things can happen.